Hi, I'm Ms. Pozak and I'm teaching writing. For today's lesson, you don't need any supplies because we're gonna make a video. So let's go ahead and get started. Last week, we did an author study on Eric Carle and we discovered what made an Eric Carle book an Eric Carle book. This week, we are going to do another author study on an author that I love and I know that you love too, Mo Willems. Mo Willems is the author of some of your favorite first grade books, Elephant and Piggy and Pigeon books. I know, now you're like, oh my gosh, he's amazing. And we all know a Mo Willems book is a Mo Willems book. We can look on a shelf and see that's an Elephant and Piggy book because we know right away that that's an Elephant and Piggy book. But, well, why? How do we know Mo Willems' style so specifically? That's what we're going to be discovering this week. In the description below, there's a playlist of lots of different Mo Willems read-alouds. And after you watch this video, I want you to watch at least one of those to discover what do you notice about his writing? What do you notice about his style? Are the characters of his books people or are they animals? Are they the same character every time or are there lots of different characters in each book? Do his books have lots of narration with somebody speaking all of what's happening or is it all just the characters talking? Are his illustrations really detailed or are they simple? Are they photographs or paintings or drawings? Do they have backgrounds or are they usually just white? All of those are different things that make a Mo Willems book a Mo Willems book. And that's what we're going to be discovering for the rest of the week. So today in writing, you are going to watch at least one Mo Willems read aloud. And then you're going to make a video on Flipgrid telling something that you notice about his writing. Then for the rest of the week, we're gonna start writing like him.